Hold on. Oh dear. No. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> soft, Mrs. <laughs> Are you so, keeping your crocs on? I'm leaving my crocs on. Well, where are we, Mrs. B? Muggington. <laughs> and it's about what 11, 12 miles from where we are. About 11 or 12 miles from Mercy and Marina. Mrs. Bonneville's putting her walking boots on with socks. As I say, I'm wandering around the Derbyshire countryside in my Crocs. Right. That's the way you rock and roll. We will do an introduction in a minute. Goodbye. Did we you miss us? <laughs> We've done where we are. We're in, we're in Muggington. It's another one of the Muggington. Cool Muggington. Yeah, it's, it's another one of these walks in the book that... Apparently, because it dates back to the Saxon times, and apparently Muggington arrives from an old Saxon name. Why are you whispering? Right, before we start this walk, which always ends up in some type of marital dispute and counselling, um, thank you very much for the comments on last week's um, or end of month podcast. Um, keep those questions coming in. Um, they were very, very good. Quick update, we're still not on the boat at time of filming this. So, um, or time you will be seeing this, it'll be early, very early October. So we are hopefully, fingers crossed, a week or so away. Right, Mrs. Bonneville, are you doing Can the I directions say, or me? Uh, no, you can't just say anything, goodbye. <laughs> OMG, did you see that? Mrs. Bonneville, make sure you put that in. I think that was either a Wellington or a Lancaster bomber. <gasps> Unbelievable. Wow. Rare as rocking horse. You know what? <sighs> right, how long is this walk, Mrs. Bonneville? Uh, four miles. Right, and what's the direction say? Um, starting from Muggington Church. Right, that's all I need to know. Muggington Church. Goodbye. Well, you, you end up reading all of them. Where's Mrs. B gone? Look, she's halfway down there already. Right, come on. And can I just say already, Muggington Village is beautiful. There are some wonderful properties. We'll try and pan around and show you a few without being too disrespectful for the, um, the residents that live in them. But Muggington is a wonderful little village. Mrs. B's right, it's about 12 miles from the uh, marina, Mercy Marina. Um, oh, look at that rose. Look, we're in horticultural channel already. Look at this, it passed its best. Oh, no, that's Mrs. Bonneville. She is a rose. Oh, and anyway. I'm not past oh. my best yet. Not quite. Silence is gone. Of course she's not. Yeah, this is um, Muggington. Beautiful. Let me just pan around so, and show you. That's where we've just come out of, guys. Just up there on the right village hall and um, it's just a sleepy sleepy little uh, village little school in front of us yeah very quaint little school um, as I say a selection of rather nice rather nice properties any property that's got a mini in the drive is going to be cool something like that here's a little school Muggington oh, Primary School. How cute is that? Come on, how cute. That'll do. What's that one there? Nice little country weekend retreat. Right, so we've got to go to the church, have we, Mrs. B? Uh, well, we'll go past the church. All oh, right. It, it, actually, yeah, it actually says to do the church last so we can investigate the church. Yeah, very nice, guys. Very nice. Look at me holding the camera over the wall. Oh, so uncouth. Lovely view over there. Yeah, it is. It's a beautiful view. These properties have got some rather splendid views. Up on the right here is the church. All Saints. All Saints. But we'll look at that. We'll look at that on the way back. We'll look at that on the way back, will we? Because it's got a, a yew tree that is a thousand years old. All right. And it's hollow. Right, Mrs. B, let me just see those instructions. Okay. What does it say? Let's, let's show the viewers what it right. says. Starting from Muggington Church, which is there, which as you walk through it, at the end of the walk is best left till then to explore. Descend to the road junction just below the church and then turn left into Green Lane. Right, that's all I need to know. 
So they left but into Green Lane. You also need to know the next bit. Almost immediately turn right through a gate gap right. and descend the field. Left into Green Lane and turn right. Let's see if we can do one more without. And get it right. Get, well. Without having to. There's the church, folks. Right, we've got to turn left down here, folks, into onto Green Lane. And then immediately right. And then immediately right. So Mrs. Bottle's in charge of the book today. Thank you. <sighs> you know what happens when I'm in charge? Yes, we get lost really quickly. <laughs> I don't know if you've heard me say before, dear viewer, Mrs. Bonneville Godlover has absolutely no sense of direction. There we are. Look, I've got me Crocs on and we're going cross country. Wendy, hold on, just a minute, Mrs. B. What is leaking from your bag? Your water is leaking everywhere. Oh, is that? Yeah. <laughs> I'm filming this. <laughs> I wondered why I'm back in my jeans all wet. I thought, oh, it has, look. Oh, it's all come out. Watch this. <laughs> live. This is live YouTube. Oh, it's all come out of the bottom of my bag. <laughs> There's our water. There's our provisions. <laughs> I didn't put lid on properly. Oh, oh. look at the back of my legs. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, oh, hold on. Oh dear. No. Oh. <laughs> <That's in my laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. You've wet yourself. What's well, the matter with you? <laughs> I've got a bee flying around my head as well. <laughs> Everything's going wrong. Oh, I can't fasten my bag now. So oh. oh, by the way, have you got any water? I'm really thirsty. Yeah, there's a little drop left. <laughs> what a muppet. Oh. Uh, yeah, so it's very wet in there. Oh, dear. I really don't care. <laughs> That's a... Do you know what? Do you know when we say, you know, and it's raining and we're going out walking, and I've always said to you before, my sister always says, you're not made of sugar. Well, do you know what? I'm not going to melt, am I? And it'll soon dry out. There's nothing important in my bag, oh, really. But I wanted a drink. I'll just bring it out a bit more. <laughs> Oh, it's only water. Whatever. Right, onwards. We haven't even done a third of a mile. God, I'm really thirsty. <laughs> Say now, Mrs B. It says, almost immediately turn right through the gate gap and descend the field with the hedge and fence on your right to a stile and pine trees. Right, stile. That's our next landmark, a stile. I don't want to know anything else. Pine trees. Stile. You've got to walk through here. Oh. Can I just say, just pan up? You've just taken the mickey out of me because that all the water spilled out of my bag. But look at my feet. Look at your feet. Need I say any more? Bothered? Does this face look bothered? I usually go first because there's spider webs. Oh, look at the cornfield. Oh, it's wet in there. <sighs> Goodbye, Crocs. Oh. Oh, oh my feet are soaking. <coughs> Creepy cornfields, strange scarecrows and spooky villains come flying through cornfields, don't they? Have I watched too many films? <laughs> she, she's wet her legs. <laughs> she's wet herself. <laughs> oh, I nearly fell over then. <laughs> right, so we'll pick back up, folks, in a moment. You don't... <sighs> Quick update, YouTube. My feet are soaked. I've stung myself. <laughs> it's my choice. I wore me... Look! <laughs> I've had these crocs on since I bought them. You are stupid. Come on. Anyway, look, update on uh, the furniture situation on the boat. We have decided um, the Aqualine Canterbury does actually come with a table that Aqualine will put on the end of the breakfast bar. Now, you've already seen the actual internal tour i will link it up on the screen now so we have decided to go for a freestanding table haven't we mrs b yeah. with four chairs we want something that is kind of reclaimed you'll know what i mean when we uh, when we show it you when we actually find it ourselves and the other big decision we've made is we were going to do we've got captain's chairs which we love We've got two captain's chairs on Love Life Triumph now about at the moment, which we'll take with us, but we're going to do a huge, big corner L, L-shape sofa that can get about eight people on. 
because Chow Bell is that big. Can I just say as well, it'll be a really interesting vlog watching us put it up together. No, 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 no. Can I just say, can I just pinch Mrs. Bonneville's strap line? Can I just say, we are not putting it up. We are going to employ or pay for the company that we end up buying the sofa off to do it. I am never going to put another sofa up on a narrowboat or a wide beam. But yeah, we've made that decision, haven't we, my love? Yeah. Um, we've obviously talked about the shelving. Again, have a look at the video. Um, but that's really it. That's all we need, really. A table and four chairs and a huge, big L-shaped sofa and a couple of massive, big rugs. And then we're good to go. Can't wait. Can't wait. Oh, and for those that have asked, we will definitely still be getting a little fur ball. Don't worry about that, folks. Left foot has just come out of me crock. <laughs> I've just put it back in. Look at the state of me. Mrs. Bonneville's wet herself, or the bag, and I, oh, my feet, folks. We're a bit like something from a carry-on film. Well, it's a little look into the future, isn't it? Mm, okay. <laughs> what was that film? What was that film with um, Kevin Costner? Comments below. Seriously, what was that film where they all came out of the cornfield to play baseball? Absolutely brilliant. Oh, what was that film? What's the next direction, please? Um, da, 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 da. Walk through these. Do no, no, does it say walk through these? Yes, because it just, I just said it just to a style and pine trees. Walk through these to another style and footbridge over McCaston Brook. Right, another style and footbridge. YouTube, quick update. Mrs. Bonneville just started to get ahead of herself then. Didn't you, Mrs. B? Do you know what it was? Admit it. Yeah. Thank do you. you. Know, do you know why? Because we've just been talking to two very Doesn't nice ladies. Doesn't matter why. She's like a butterfly. Over, and we were just having a little bit of a gossip mm. and stuff. So it threw me a bit. Yeah. That's my excuse. She's it? like a butterfly, folks. Right. Not till I get to that footbridge, Mrs. Bonneville, shall I want to know what the next set of directions are. <laughs> <laughs> yes, goodbye. Right, hold on a minute. What is the next set of directions? It says, turn half left and ascend gently to the water channel and keep it on your right. How do you turn half left? Never mind. This is where Mrs. Bonneville view viewers starts to go into what I call guest mode. Let's guess the walk. Look at her over there. Look. But that's more interesting, isn't it? No, it's not. It's how we end up love walking, but sometimes these books <laughs> we're lost, Mrs. B. How long have we been doing this walk? About oh, 15 minutes. 15 we're minutes. Already... Well, we're going to try up here. We think it's up here. We are going to try up here, this but the same. look of us being lost. <laughs> is it us? <laughs> it's not. Um, we love walking, we absolutely love it, and believe you me, Mr. and Mrs. YouTube, I know my sense of direction, but the book doesn't give great directions on some of the walks. It does ask us to go towards the farm and there is a farm across there. Right, well, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll walk over there for 10 minutes. So Update we YouTube, we've turned around and we are going, well, we don't know where we're going. <laughs> I have actually suggested to Mrs. B that we're gonna do a little bit of research and invest another book this evening we've enjoyed john's brilliant book we've actually done quite a few of the walks haven't we my love yeah. we're actually on the lookout for a trout pond <laughs> what's a trout pond it's got to be a pond with trout in it <laughs> one would think yeah and you haven't your rod i haven't fetched my rod oh clip in here look me there. catching a fish recently well good morning folks it's mr bonneville here i'm sure mrs bonneville will clip this lovely fish it's a bream that i've just caught and I'm going to pop him back in. Let me just show you. Come here. That's a little village of Muggington. I think Mrs. Bonneville thinks I've got a £10,000 camera. There you go. Let me zoom in on it. There you go. It's more like a hamlet. By the way, we are so late to the game. Uh, Paul Whitehouse and Bob Mortimer. What's it called? Uh, gone fishing. Gone fishing. Because I've just taken up fishing, we have recently discovered it. We are on the final series. We just started it last night. What a brilliant, brilliant little... And away. 
<laughs> yeah. Oh, it's just brilliant. If you've not watched it, Gone Fishing. Not just for the fishing, but just the general light-hearted banter and humour and they go to some wonderful places oh, and yeah. Bob books some brilliant accommodation for Paul and himself. Um, yeah, Gone Fishing. Go and have a look at that. Yeah, it is amazing. Absolutely. Right. Come on. Just saying, folks, even though we are lost, we can still vlog. Still take it to... It's nice. You know, it's a bit like a mystery tour. We have no idea now where we're heading. No. We've got, we've got an idea, but we don't really know where we are. We've never been here before in our life. Oh, a style. <laughs> oh, that looks promising. That There's looks a promising. style everywhere. Where's the trout pond? There's the footbridge, look. Instead of footbridge. I'm not going anywhere till I see the trout pond. That's how people lose their lives, Mrs. B. So, the trout farm on the right. We don't even know where the trout farm is, though, do we? Well, we presume it's over there. <laughs> we, we think, we think there's trout there. I'll, oh! <laughs> Every time we use that book. <laughs> it starts it off. It never starts off. No, but the first year that we did, we got it right, didn't we? It's just... It's just gone down a little bit. <laughs> Promise you, next time we do a walk, we'll have a proper book. Not knocking that, it's been great, but it's just no. Come on, yes. Do you try and pull that gate? <laughs> they don't want you coming through here. Oh, God, they don't, do they? That's oh, hard. That, what, mind your fingers. <laughs> Oof. Oh, is that a landmark there, that grey thing stuck up? I think it is, isn't it? Let's go towards there. Hey, is that a trout pond? Welcome to uh, one man and his dog without a dog. Yeah. Welcome to farming. <laughs> <laughs> Look, even the sheep are looking at us. Oh, they're going just for goodness <laughs> they're sake. They're like, will you please way. get out of our field? Yes, and find your way. And we don't want any negative comments. It is a public right of way. Yeah, we have followed the signs. We have followed the signs. Right, Mrs B. <gasps> footbridge. <laughs> yeah, but does it say footbridge over a river or yeah. stream? Stepping stones. Stepping stones. <laughs> well, no stepping. We haven't got a clue where we are, you two. Okay. I sent diagonally to the right across the field to a stile. Right, so I wonder if this is a field and we go towards a stile. I wonder if this is a field, did you say? Yeah, I sent diagonally. Do you think that's a field, do you, viewer? Yeah, of course it's a field. <laughs> Just the irony is they're all fields, oh. Mrs. B, aren't they? Oh, dear. Don't you dare negative comment about my wife. Because I love her. Someone's got to take her. <laughs> it's oh. up. Straight up. <laughs> Look, it's a field, she says. <laughs> like it's the first one today. I'm still in hope of the book. <laughs> Mrs Bonneville sees a field and a star. It's like, we know where we are. <laughs> oh, look. We're around, can't we? No, let's go through. <laughs> let's go down and then we can come back up here. Look, see. look. Hello, fella. Do you know where there's a stile, footbridge, and stepping stones? <laughs> Please. <laughs> With no food, we haven't even got any water, fella. Because that muppet there, yeah, that one with the red coat on. Hello. <laughs> Don't follow her, fella. She's got nothing. Got nothing. Should we go through that style, then? Right, come on. <laughs> I've lost it now. I've lost it, YouTube. I'm just laughing now and avoiding the... Uh... Oh, hello. I, I know. You just said hello. I know. Hello, fella. Hello. Do you know where there's a footbridge? A style and stepping stones. It might not be in that order. No? Is it this way? That's where we come from up there. Can you see? Let me zoom in, folks. There's the church, look. So we've sort of come see? round. We've come round, we took a great big circle round, 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 round. And here we are at the moment. We've come all the way round there, up this hill, and we've arrived at a very picturesque water treatment works. Can't live without him. We've actually caught up with the book. Yeah, eventually. Um, <laughs> we've caught up by luck. Haven't we, my love? Oh, right, no. next. Ne what's the next? Oh, it's got ice cream there. It's got ice cream. Oh, yeah. wow. Yeah. I've got no money on me. Did you take switch? Oh, I ain't got any either. Well, even if I had it, it'd be all wet. <laughs> it's all wet. <laughs> Should we go and see if we can get an ice cream? Let's go and see if we can get an ice cream. That takes a couple.
card. Oh, look at these. Oh, how cute. Careful because she's got a big one. Oh, how cute. Look in there. Wow. Oh, look at those. Lovely. I've just had the blame for not having any money. We're a team. <laughs> Why is it always my fault for not having any cash on me? It's not finished, folks. You think it's over, but it's not. Stay tuned. Yeah, the agony continues yeah, for you. The agony continues. Bonus footage at the end of me and Mrs. Bonneville looking happy. <laughs> <laughs> right. Okay. So walk uphill with edge on the right to a style. How many more fields do you want to see, YouTube? <sighs> right. Let's go and have a look at the, uh, the church, shall we? Muggington. We've been lucky with the weather today. As I say, time of filming this, it's... Uh, it hasn't been muggy. <laughs> it's not been muggy. No, time of filming this, it's the uh, almost the end of September. I'll close the gate. Close the gate, Mrs B. It's famous for three things, this apparently, this church. It's famous for three things. What are they? The 1,000-year-old yew tree, uh, the Saxon west window, and the altar. Let's go and have a look. Here it is, folks. Look, 1,000-year-old yew tree. Mrs Bonneville, as I say, is going to clip a little photo in. Yeah, if you have a look down here, it's the, um, it's the rector and the, uh, the schoolmistress in 1869 having tea in here. So that's not 1,000 years, though. No, oh, that's the when they had tea. Oh, that's I see. Tea. Wow. Never mind, folks. The church isn't open. But let's just show you All Saints, Muggington and Catliston. A few little shots of the church. It's such a shame, for whatever reason, that our churches at the moment seem to be quite hit and miss in terms of them being open. Never mind. see you next time thanks for sticking with us as i say we're only a couple of weeks away from getting our wide beam so um yeah we will show you that and um yeah like subscribe all that stuff because it's free so come on hit the like and hit the subscribe button it doesn't do you any harm right see you later see you later bye goodbye bye, bye. <laughs> mrs bonneville <laughs> What have you done? Look, look, your bag's still dripping. <laughs> with the trout ponds. What's a trout pond? Exactly. Is that, is that a pond with trout in know. it? I what don't are you know. doing? <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've, put, I've put a bit of weight around. Yeah. <laughs> you haven't put any weight, it's your bag. <laughs> What's the next landmark after the trout? <laughs> I'm so fed up, Mrs. B. I, <laughs> oh, can you see me filling? That's, like, that's like we've got a drone. <laughs> Hello. Yeah. <laughs> oh, by the way, I keep getting comments for saying goodbye. Stop saying it. No, it's our channel. Greatest of respect. No. <laughs> Guess what? Goodbye. <laughs>